Hello friends, in this video we will see the operation of TI make primary injection test set 400 ampere 3 phase unbalanced type. The instrument is designed in two parts, one is control unit and other is loading unit. Both enclosures are MS powder coated type, hence it is RUJ in design. Here it comes control panel by opening butterfly type 2 locks. And now you could see why we called it unbalanced type because it is three phases but all three phases could be individually controlled without interrupting other phase. Output terminals of the instrument are also individual for all three phases. Now let's see basic view of control panel. There is one MCB, four pole for mains input. There are three indicators of three phases which indicates input supply is on. There is one multifunction meter for indication of output ampere to push buttons for test on and off and same as two indicators to indicate whether output is on or off. Green for output on and red for output off. Now we discuss about accessories. There is one 3 meters long mains probe and three set of 5 meters long output high current leads. 3 meters long interconnect wire set. Input mains probe is 4 core wire and as per their color we need to feed input supply as R, Y, B and N at open end of probe and plug to be inserted in socket mounted on instrument's control panel. Interconnect wire should be connected between control panel and loading unit. All wires are plug to plug type and hence easy to detect and easy to connect. As well on both units, it is clearly marked where to connect. Now for demonstration, we will use set of output high current leads to draw output current but we will use only one wire from set. We will shorted both output terminals of each individual phase means R to R and Y to Y and B to B. Also we need to connect interconnect wires as per their marking on both units. Now we will make the mains on by opening MCB mounted on instrument control panel. See, we got the mains input and all phases indicators glows. Panel meters auxiliary supply also switched on. Now we need to make sure that meters display should be tuned to ampere only. If it is not, then press A button on meters panel and immediately we will got the meters display tuned to ampere screen. As we are first time operating the instrument, we will operate it from minimum position of ampere. So we will ensure that all three phases variate position is at minimum side. After ensuring minimum position, press test on green button and sudden output will be switched on. For trial purpose, we will increase any of phase. Let go to our phase. You can see by rotating knob of R phase variate to clockwise direction, the output of R phase is increasing gradually. Let's do some reference. We will cross check the panel meter with live testing at output lead by increasing a clamp meter. You can see both readings are almost same. Now move on to Y phase increase ampere of Y phase and which will not affect R phase ampere as well B phase ampere. Same as if we change ampere of B phase will not affect R or Y phase ampere. This is called unbalanced type test set. In this manner we could feed any desired ampere to any of phase individually. Once we use the instrument, output leads might possibly get heated as we use it as short circuit leads. So after test completion, need to assure that output lead must not be overheated. Once it cools down at ambient temperature, then only restore the leads. 
hope the video was helpful if found any query please feel free to contact us thank you for watching have a nice time ahead